From the Windy City and airing live here on Fight Network, Glory 38 went down on Friday night. The main event pitted Russian light heavyweight champion Artem Vakitov against the man he defeated to claim the title in Brazilian Salo Cavallari. This is, however, the third time the two have squared off, with each claiming a victory over the other going into the rubber match. Although an entertaining belt throughout, the real action started in the second round where the champion would find an opening for his right hand, scoring two knockdowns before trapping the Brazilian in the corner, switching to a southpaw stance and unloading with hard lefts. Shortly afterward, referee Chris Wagner would call a halt to the fight, declaring your winner and still champion, Artem Vakitov. In traditional glory fashion, the night featured a one-night contenders tournament, this time in the light heavyweight division. The semifinals saw Zinedine Hamour Lane punch his ticket to the finals with a violent second round knockout over late replacement Brian Collette. Oh my word! What a right hand by Zinedine Hammerlay! Hammerlay said that his right hand is his strongest weapon. He knocked out Warren Thompson with it and he just knocked out Brian Collette. On the other side of the bracket, Brazilian Ariel Machado took on Daniel Ilanga. This entertaining affair saw some wild exchanges. A clash of heads would open a nasty cut on the crown of Machado's head, but that wouldn't at all waver the Brazilian. Keeping aggressive, Machado would find openings for his overhand right, scoring a brief knockdown in the third round over the former It's Showtime champion and winning a unanimous decision. With our final bracket set, Ariel Machado would surprisingly make quick work of Zinedine Hamor Lane. Despite clearing having a tougher semi-final bout, Machado came out as fresh as he can be, scoring a very strange knockout in the first round as Zinedine Hamor Lane would turn his back on his opponent and falling for the 10 count. Despite all of this, Ariel Machado looks spectacular throughout the night, now earning himself a shot at Artem Vakitov's title. Moving on to the Glory 38 Super Fight Series, we saw a highly anticipated bout between heavyweight contenders Benjamin Adek Bowie and Anderson Silva. Adek Bowie just recently won the Glory Heavyweight Contenders Tournament, earning himself a third shot at Rico Verhoeven's title. But Friday night, his opponent Anderson Silva was game, finding a home for his stinging left hand in the first round. In the second, Adek Bowie was landing some hard hooks, but once again, Silva found his opening. This time a powerful head kick which rocked the number one ranked contender. Heading into the third, it was a tough one to score. Adek Bowie overall had the better conditioning, able to circle around the Brazilian and dig in with leg kicks. Those kicks would eventually lead to a knockdown, tying the fight on the judges scorecards. Because of the draw, we went to extra rounds. Adek Bowie's superior conditioning once again played the biggest factor, scoring another knockdown on the withering Brazilian. Overall, valiant effort by Anderson Silva, but in the end, Benjamin Adek Bowie was declared your winner by decision. Notable undercard action included a pair of knockouts. First off, Romanian heavyweight Catalan Morisanu picked up a stellar knockout over late replacement Maurice Green. And in the welterweight division, the Dutch predator Myrthel Gronhardt scored a pair of knockdowns to earn a third round knockout victory over Tung Chai.